Hi, I'm Eric Kuhn, Senior Product Manager with Furuno. And today we're on the Time Zero test boat and we're looking at the combination of the new Furuno DFF3D multi-beam sonar with Time Zero Professional. And we're going to show you what the combination can generate in terms of personal bathymetric generation or PBG as well as all the other modes that are possible with Time Zero Professional. It's excellent. You can see the kind of presentations that we can get. For example, we have a vertical profile mode. And in a vertical profile mode, the DFF3D can give you information at a 120 degree swath under the boat. As you go deeper, that actually gets wider. So the nice thing about the DFF3D is that when you're in, say, 30, 40, 50 meters of water, it actually gets wider and wider and the coverage doesn't lose any resolution because you're getting all that information from this multi-beam system generated at the same time. Unlike a tra uh, traditional echo sounder that will only give you basically one data point per second, the DFF3D combined with Time Zero Professional can generate 50 data points per second. That's just imagine how much more area you can cover with PBG data than you could with a traditional echo sounder using this combination. Let's look at some other modes. For example, Here's a combination of the triple beam down sounder mode from the DFF3D combined with the vertical profile on the right hand side. And the nice thing about this mode is I can actually look at where the beams are pointed from the DFF3D. We can have either three beams or a single beam down sounder and actually combine that and look at where the fish are or where the structure is underneath the vessel. Not just underneath, but off to the sides is the important thing to understand. And you can see here on the left-hand side, we can also generate a 3D history mode. So if we run over a wreck or run over structure, run over fish that we're interested in, in targeting, we can actually look at that data, capture it. I can click on it, save it as a waypoint, go back and fish that spot right away. It's really excellent. Right now we're looking at a side scan presentation of the DFF3D on Time Zero Professional. And you can see how we actually get pretty good detail considering the 165 kilohertz frequency of the DFF3D. Yes, it's actually possible to see tree branches and structure in shallow water with this combination. But when we jump over to the PBG mode is where the real power of Time Zero Professional and, DF and the DFF3D combined to create some incredible presentations. You can look at the screen and see how we're looking at both the vertical profile mode in the upper right hand corner as well as the, um, the 3D cube mode which is a PBG presentation as well as the actual PBG bottom spread presentation on a traditional chart. And one of the nice things you can see here is that the wide angle PBG that's capable, uh, that's possible from the DFF3D is producing many more data points than you can get with a traditional echo sounder trying to do the same thing with PBG. For example, a traditional echo sounder only generates one point per second, but the DFF3D can actually generate 50 points per second in that same area. So you're not just getting a small dot of, of depth data, you're getting a wide angle presentation of depth angle of depth data and the resolution is far, far higher than any echo sounder can generate. For more information on the DFF3D, visit FurunaUSA.com and for more information on the incredible power of the Time Zero professional software, go to MyTimeZero.com. You can see a full explanation with more details about the system there.